We are so excited to announce the first treatment for Duchenne has been approved by the FDA. After 13 years of our work to find a cure for Duchenne muscular dystrophy, the FDA has approved Sarepta Zetepersen. Duchenne muscular dystrophy is a genetic muscle wasting disease that will gradually lose the ability to walk and use his limbs. When my son Hawken was diagnosed, we were told there's no hope. Go home and love your son. We knew early on that we had to take an innovative approach to cure this disease for our son and the others who live with Duchenne muscular dystrophy. What's interesting is I was able to be involved with Cure Duchenne even before I began working at Sarepta. I was asked by Deborah Miller to be on the scientific advisory board. And it was a, really a wonderful relationship to work with some of the, really the, the best scientists in the field of Duchenne muscular dystrophy. So we found the top scientific experts determined the most viable paths to a cure, and began funding promising projects, including a small company called Sarepta Therapeutics at a critical juncture in the development of their drug. I'm in a trial, so I have to go to Long Beach every week and get the medicine. We all noticed was that his energy level just shot up. Since I've been taking the medicine, I've been able to walk a little farther and like one little farther. Ever since I was diagnosed, all the doctors are saying by the time I'm 13, I would be in a wheelchair and not be able to do things I could do now. But since I've been on the medicine, I am still walking, swimming, playing with my friends and my dog, which people say I could not do at this age. Gertishan provided funding to Sarepta in 2010 to conduct studies that enabled it to get off clinical hold and move into human clinical trials for Etepler-Sin. So Cure Duchenne helped us uh, very early in the development program, so they gave us a jump start uh, on our clinical trial development. Getting funding um, allows for a small company to accelerate. While Duchenne might be a rare disease, the impact it has on those affected and their families is enormous. An approved treatment means that positive things are happening and more positive things will follow. And so there's an abundance of hope and things to look forward to. Having the first approved drug for Duchenne is an amazing milestone for the Duchenne community. However, it only helps 13% of the boys currently affected with Duchenne. Our son Henry is part of the 87% who won't be helped by this first treatment, but he will be helped by another treatment down the road. Is this is a very long journey. Uh, I would look at Teplerson as the first step. Would really be the first step in a long process of trying to get better and better drugs for this community. It's, it's not just about Evan, it's, it's, it's about everybody. It would be saving thousands and thousands of lives. Paul and Deborah have been an inspiration on what they've been able to do. It's personalized it, it's not just a fundraiser, it's, it's people's lives. We also now know essentially how to make a similar treatment for the rest of those affected. We just need to fund the research. It's not the science anymore, it's the funding. We can't stop now. We need to keep the momentum going. Now that we know there is a treatment out there, we need to not stop working until we have a treatment for every boy with Duchenne. Once again, congratulations to Sarepta and to those families who will soon have a treatment. We are so proud of the Cure Duchenne team, of the fantastic biotech companies working toward a cure, and most of all, you are incredible Duchenne community.